everybody welcome back to my channel it's the only with thrifty divas it is saturday morning it is like 7 20 a.m the sun is just making its way up um i get up at 5 30 every morning so apparently my sleeping in on the weekend is 5 40 naturally so i got up at 5 40 um without an alarm and i was like you know what uh i've had a blood work prescription that was dated August 19th that I still haven't done fasting blood work so I'm like I'm gonna go do that now they opened at 6 30 so I just went there got blood drawn came back and I was like got my coffee now since it was fasting blood work um, and yeah I was like you know what everybody in the house is still sleeping let me just do that back seat haul sounds good I think it sounds good all right so let's do it what do we got Okay. It's been in here so long. We're going to be surprised together cuz I don't even know what's in here. Okay. Ah. Now this is like from a walkthrough video that I did I don't even know, a week, two weeks ago, I don't know. But I finally found this and if you watched the walkthrough video as I was going through the shelf um, I had already taken it at that time when I filmed it, I believe, but I was digging through that shelf and I was like, tell me I missed out on all of these because they had every other design. Um, and then I lucked out and found one. So I got the last one in that particular store and I am noticing that in all the other stores that I go to, they have every other one, every other design lined up all nicely, not the red truck. So it flies flies out of there so I'm I'm very happy I got myself one all right then I picked up this I picked up this gingerbread cookies oven mitt with the recipe and then the matching pot holders that just say gingerbread cookies I love them uh, I don't particularly need them so I think I'm gonna throw this in my Christmas giveaway as well those were my thoughts when I was picking them up I was like I really love it uh, but I don't need it for myself. And then I was like, oh, I'll just, I'll put it in the Christmas giveaway. Because I like it so much. Alright, then if you remember my Ray Dunn inspired mugs. And um, the store I found them at did not have a his of any kind. I have still not been able to find it. But what I did find at a store, this is also Plates and Beyond. This is dishwasher and microwave safe. And this says, good morning, handsome. And it's white on the inside. And it's a nice big mug as well. So I figured my husband might like that. And I'll probably just keep that for him for Christmas. And fill it with some Starbucks cake Which is his favorite. So. Then I got two bags of these New York style bagel crisps. They expire September of next year. These are 7.2 ounces, and I just got the sea salt. They had garlic as well, and I was contemplating getting it, but then I thought about it, and anytime I eat anything with, like, garlic powder or, um, like, any type of artificial garlic things, you know, or, like, Funyuns, that taste, like, stays in your mouth for entirely longer than you would want it to so I, like as I was about to pick up the garlic ones I like pictured eating them and I was like no that garlic taste is gonna stay in my mouth for like a week no so not a week but you know you know me and my exaggerations then I picked up these Brenton 3.95 ounce sesame crackers So I picked up two of those. I was thinking the Christmas Eve gathering at my house. So yeah, got those. And then this is a wish list item um, and it's apparently split up. This is the only time I've ever seen it and I was ecstatic to find it. These expire July of 2020. And I saw Anna at Only In My Dreams haul them, and I'm like, no! And I was on a mission, and I found them at one store. So 
again, pleasantly pleased. Um, this is the Alka-Seltzer Plus Severe Sinus Congestion and Cough Cold Medicine. You get 12 of the daytime, 8 in the nighttime in the same pack. So for a dollar, that is freaking amazing. And I think I got 8 or 9 of them. There's 4 here, but like I said, they're in other bags. Sorry for the rustling. <laughs> My car's still running. I just stepped on the gas and revved the engine unintentionally. Okay. This bag is super heavy. Oh, it's books. There's books in here, that's why. Okay. All right, so this is the other one of the um, kitchen sets that I found for my son. So again, knife cutting board, and this one is an apple and a pineapple with the Velcro on it that you can cut with the knife. So I found one more. Again, that was the only one in this store too. So now I have two kinds. Uh, I believe Lisa and Will's Halls told me that it was three or four. I can't remember. Three, I think. Three designs they have in that. Then I got these paint posters. Now, normally these are just like the little pages, but they have these big ones. This is the one with the paint built into the bottom of the page where you just wet your brush, put it on here, pick up paint and then paint and repeat. So you just paint with water, but the paint is separate down here. And it also comes with a sticker sheet. Um, and yeah, so you get eight, eight of the posters, one paintbrush, and five stickers so i got this one in the uh sea life for my son i think there's another one in another bag somewhere then i got uh, a few of these for my parents So I got, I found another one of these. Um, I had bought one of these for my parents once and now I can have one for myself. This is the country skills, wisdom for growing your own food, raising animals, canning and fermenting and more. This retailed for $14.99. Then I picked up this book for myself. This was $12.99 wherever it was sold, although it retails for $19.99 US. And this is Easy as pie pops, small in size and huge on flavor and fun. Look at those. They're little pie pops. Isn't that awesome? Yeah, I, I don't know if I'll be able to do these, but I'm willing to give it a try because that looks so cool. So cool. So grabbed that one. Got this one for my stepfather, Showdown Comfort Food Chili and Barbecue. This retails for $21.99 on the back. And I also got this for my stepfather, Grill to Perfection. Two champion pit masters share recipes and techniques for unforgettable backyard grilling. This also says $21.99 on the back. These are stuck in here. Oh my goodness. Then I got this really beautiful book, All American Paleo Table. So this is a classic home style cooking from a grain free perspective. So it's not gonna be for everybody, but it definitely looks very interesting. And this says it retails for $28. So. Chipotle tri-tip bowls, fried chicken cob salad, 
tells you about cauliflower rice and it has three different flavors for that things like that and then this one looked really really nice to me modern Israeli cooking uh, this retails for $28 on the back oh this one was 28 on the back too did I tell you that paleo table so yeah $28 um, and I just I think it looks super super good it has sumac fries chicken and dumplings and dumplings curry lamb chops so I just thought it looked like a really nice book okay next I picked up this Paw Patrol plastic little stocking bag what does it say on it party tote bag so I got this probably just I should have gotten more but like as gift bags you know for my son for his Christmas presents I thought that was adorable and they had Star Wars and something else that I can't remember all right so this bag has a whole bunch more of the Alka-Seltzer cold medicine in there but we're not going to take that out all right and here is another one of the uh, magic paint posters and this one is in dinosaurs and there's the stickers on that one and those are your eight posters in the back okay then I grabbed two of the Remy Rose I grabbed the cream lipstick in Nicole um, which is actually a very 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 bright red um, but it's not picking that up on the camera at all it's a lot brighter and redder in person than it's looking on the camera because I can see it and it looks very rosy in the camera but this is like red um, and then I picked up the liquid lipstick in the Kristen which is this color picked up these sassy and chic nails so two packs of those for the sizing and there's going to be another one it's going to be another one. Oh no Pardon me, pardon me. Okay. Then I picked up three of these. They're, they ha they're coming out with these for Christmas, and I think they're such a great deal, and they just look so nice um, for kids' gifts. You know, pick them up now, save them for your kids' if they have to go to birthday parties and stuff throughout the year I think they're great so they have two different kinds they have a 14 piece poster set um, which comes with 14 it comes with three glitter posters six mini posters five velvet posters and four markers and those are uh, yeah so it's 14 posters all together but they have Mickey and those the 14 ones have this clear window so in another 14 I got Toy Story 4 and then they have this other kind which is eight velvet posters so it comes with eight velvet posters and four markers so I'm hoping hopefully these posters are a little bigger but it doesn't look like they are anyway but th this does not have a window this one with the eight so I got this in the Lion King these are the posters there so yeah I got those three then I got these tins which I really liked because they're hinged 
I believe the last tins I got weren't hinged. So, I got two in these, in the dinosaur design. It's the same one, they had like the notebooks out and all that. So, you see they're hinged, these metal tins. So I love these for small toys, pencils, markers, crayons, whatever, for my son. Then for me, for makeup, makeup brushes, makeup pencils, I got this one that says Be Your Own Beautiful in the pink. This matches those little tote bags they had come out with the way back. And then they had... And that was pink top and bottom. Then they have this one where the lid looks like this. And then the bottom is purple. Again, hinged. And I think quite possibly my favorite, they have this mermaid scale one. And this has like a cream colored bottom. So yeah, grab those. One more design of nails, because Sassy and Chic is killing me with the nails. These are just really sweet, I thought. They're just these kind of beigey nude ones, and then they have like glitter, like ombre glitter, you know, cascading down. So nice and subtle and cute and short, and I just love them. So I grabbed those too. Then I found, well, my mom asked me to pick her up these if I found them again. These are the Snyder six lunch packs of the little mini pretzels. The reason why she wants them, if you don't know, these are one Weight Watchers point per bag. One. So she says they save her life throughout the day when she's teaching and stuff. So I was like, I got you. So I grabbed her more. Then I found these awesome things. These expire February 21. So these are fresh baked dog treats. Foppers Gourmet Pet Treat Bakery. Made in the USA. Foppers with an F like Frank. Um, in Logansport, Indiana. So these are these little dog cookies and they're shaped like hearts and they kind of do have a red and green thing going on. Uh, does it say how much they, it's uh, no, four ounces, four ounce weight. But I did pick up five of these. I picked up five of these to, to give to Christmas gifts for everybody who's got doggies in my life. Doesn't that look so nice? I feel like it looks a lot more than a dollar. So yeah, five of those. And that was the only like cookie I saw, like these hearts with the red and green-ish. And then I grabbed these to give a try. They had three different styles of them. But these are night vision glasses. So they have like a yellow thing going on. Um, they are zip tied, so I can't take them off of the package. They're zip tied right here. Um, but, you know, it's going to start getting, we change our clocks tonight. Um, it's going to start getting darker a lot earlier. And I have long drives home and I'm tired and contacts, issues, whatever. So I figure for the glare of lights, let me give that a try. Maybe it'll make my drive more pleasant sometimes. Because sometimes when I'm tired, it does bother me. And I'm sure that'll just keep getting worse the older I get. So I found these pens by the register and I was so shocked to see them that I grabbed all three because I panic. So they have these with this holographic green body and this mermaid tail. <clears throat> and this is actually reversible to a matte black. It's a matte black. And then it's blue and green when it's up. And it is 
black ink. So that's one. Then they have this multicolor Norwal on a silver body. And this flips to silver, shiny silver. <clears throat> okay. And then they have this gold star on a gold holographic body. And this also flips to shiny silver. So this is the this is the odd man out. This is this flips to matte black. Actually, it's matte black. It's weird. There's some matte black pieces in there, but this is almost a very, very dark, uh, almost like that oil slick, like dark oil slick color. Really weird. See? You have to like move it around to see it. Very interesting. Very interesting. But yeah, so cool. And these, at least in my store, this was it. The mermaid tail came in this, the star came in this, the normal came in this. Nothing else. No varieties. Boom, boom, boom. That was it. So I grabbed those. And then I picked up three of the white tinsel garland with the red truck on it. So they also had it in silver. And I believe they had it in green. Um... I was torn, but then I think it really just pops better on the white. So I picked up three of the white. You get nine feet on these. And then I got this wall art. They had three or four different variations of this. I got this because it has two puppies in it. Um, and that's what this looks like, if you can see that. Right, Santa, penguins, um, here's one puppy, here's another puppy, gingerbread man stocking, uh, sled, and snowman. And so it looks like they just peel off of here. I got this for my office. We're getting our offices next week in case anybody is wondering what's going on. We're getting our offices next week, and I've already gone on the record three times before two different judges, so it's starting. They're assigning us our teams next week too, so yeah, it's it's all it's all starting. And then I found just one of these, and these are the big ones. Um, and I saw Kathy from Kathy's Favorite Things uh, haul the smaller ones, but this is all I found, and it was a little ripped. I just hope they're all in here. You probably are, because you know how doilies stick together, like, oh, holy hell. So they're uh, ten and a half by ten and a half. They're not square. Why don't they just say ten and a half? Anyway, these poinsettia doilies, thought those were super cute to line your trays with when you're doing anything. All right, last few items, guys. We're finishing. Then I found these gift boxes. You get three and you get Merry Christmas with a poinsettia and on the same box is the red truck so this is the box right here Merry Christmas poinsettia red truck uh, and it has like I don't know if you're gonna be able to see like almost like snow falling in the back then so that's the rectangular one. Then there's the square one that says, have yourself a merry little Christmas. That's what the sides look like. And then you get this long one with these poinsettias on it. And it's white on the bottom. I thought this was very interesting. So this says, yeah, this is wrong. <laughs> this is all very wrong, I think. Maybe. So they're calling this a gift card box. Yeah, okay. Gift card box, bracelet. That'd have to be a pretty small bracelet because it's a pretty small box. And then they're saying necklace on this. So these have changed. Anyway, this is, this just caught my, look how small these are. You see how narrow these are? Right? Isn't that weird? It's like a pen box. Like if you get somebody a really nice, like, you know cross pen or whatever expensive pens are 
weird. But that's what they are. They're claiming it's a necklace box, though. I don't know how I feel about that. Uh, and I got three of those. So, the last item I did not buy myself because I haven't been able to find it. A friend of mine at work from Nassau was like, I'll check at mine. And brought me in six of the Ooh La La palettes. <coughs> So now the only thing I'm desperately looking for is the cake boss stuff, and I'm going to find it. You watch me. Hope I didn't just jinx myself. Anyway, in case you have not seen this, <coughs> which I'm sure you have by now. Now, just be forewarned. So this has talc in it. Um, and it is distributed in California, but it is made in China. Okay, just so you know. So this is by City Color Cosmetics, citycolorcosmetics.com. And this is the Ooh La La palette. And all of the colors are named after French things. You have Mona Lisa, Notre Dame, Moulin Rouge, um, the thing I could never say, the Louvre, the Eiffel Tower, Versailles, Arc de Triomphe, Macaron, and then the, the river, <laughs> the Seine. Seine River. I don't know how to say it. Um, and the Champs. Yeah, no, I'm not. This one. This one right here. Okay. So those are your colors. All named after Paris things. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So my friend grabbed me six. And I am ecstatic. <clears throat> one is for me. One is for like Secret Santa at work if I get a girl. Um, and then I'm saving the rest, like the four, for like, get, you know, things things that pop up throughout the year. Birthdays, etc., etc. Awesome, 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 awesome. And if I ever find them myself, I will buy more. So that's it, guys. Holy cow, I'm so sorry. That is so long. I'm so sorry. All right. Well, we're done, and at least I got, I finally got the back seat haul done, and, uh, yeah. Sorry. So, that's it. You'll see me very soon. I have so many DIYs that I really have to do for the fall season, uh, and I have, like, no time. And I still haven't gotten my car from my mom's house. Uh, I have to definitely clean out this car. I have to do stuff in the house. Um, I have a product review video that I need to do. And then I have another one coming. I also have seven packages of friend mail. Oh my God, I forgot that I have to do. I have a shop miss a haul that I think came in three weeks ago. I'm a mess. But yeah. So anyway, long story kind of long um you'll see me very very soon i'm doing my best i'm crazed but thank you all so much for spending so much time with me today i'm so sorry it's so long and um some people will love it some people will hate it it's like you know so so thank you to the ones that love it i'm so sorry to the ones that hate it and yeah until the next video stay blessed everybody i love each and every one of you and don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and hit that notification bell so you get notified anytime i upload new content and uh you know like comment share all that stuff youtube analytics um all right so yeah i gotta go i gotta go and i will see you all soon